his job was to protect and serve, but what a former Tampa police officer is accused of doing during a traffic stop is a sickening betrayal of trust. Investigators tell us Adam York was on his way to work when he pulled a woman over and violated her. News Channel 8's Rod Carter joins us now live from the Tampa Police Headquarters tonight. Rod, this arrest is not only a shock for the community, but for the force as well, right? Yeah, it's shocking, and quite frankly, for the police chief here, he is absolutely angry. It's been a six-month investigation into this, into this, and today, that now former officer turned himself in. It was a shock to us. Police Chief Eric Ward is angry. Today, he held a news conference to announce he had to fire one of his own. Now, former officer Adam York is fired for allegedly committing sexual battery on a woman during a traffic stop. Well, he was on his way to work, coming into work for duty and uh, the victim was observed speeding, and that's how the traffic stop was conducted. This grainy surveillance video shows police lights off in the distance. It came from this camera outside of J.C. Penney near West Shore and Kennedy Boulevard. Although this happened on February 1st, York was actually fired a month later and only charged and arrested today. During a traffic stop, an officer, she didn't know who or what agency, um, pull over. Now, according to this criminal report affidavit, police were able to get DNA evidence from the victim, and that, they say, is how they determined that it was Officer York. We stopped by the Clearwater home where York lives with his wife and family. No one answered the door. Neighbors didn't want to talk either. Chief Ward is talking, though. He is extremely disappointed. We hold our office to a very high standard, and those that fail to meet those standards are dealt with seriously. York had been with the force for about 12 years, and the only blemish he had on his record was actually missing a court date. Now, we did reach out to his attorney today for a comment, but we have not heard back from him. Josh? Okay, Rod Carter, live force in Tampa. Thanks, Rod.